I created the best Brazilian Brookhaven and the best United States one of all time. And this is why all this happened. Who's better, Brazil or the United States? USA is definitely much better. Does one of them need to be better? I think they're both oh. good. That's a lie. Brazil is a lot better. Shut up. Whoa, guys. You don't need to fight like that. Create a Brookhaven for Brazil. No, make one for the United States. Technically, I can only do one of those, but I can work something out. Here in Roblox Studio, we'll start by getting this red wall. This is what will divide each part of the map. We just need to make it a lot bigger to get through all of it. Let's just make it more transparent, and I think that actually looks great. This right side is gonna be Brazilian Brookhaven. So let us start with a big flag, of course. And on the other side, we'll get the United States one as well. Let's start with the Brazilian side. Let's see some vehicles. We can start by getting this Brazilian police car. This one is quite famous around there too. And also a bunch more cars you can find around a bunch of Brazilian cities. With that, we got a lot. I even grabbed these personalized Brazil ones. Now, so everyone knows which part this is, I'll put these letters above the arch. I think that'll look great. We should get a Brazilian flag on there too. Let's turn over to the airport and delete that old plane. In its place, we'll be getting this nice looking one here. It's even written Fly Brazil. I also want to change the color of the trees. This one's gonna be green. Then this one will be yellow. And now that one's blue. Those are the colors of the Brazilian flag. So we gotta do that all over this side. There we go. Now we have some colorful trees. Hey, add football for us too. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Everyone knows Brazil's fame in the football game. So let's delete a few of these things to open up some space. And let's add some fields for them to play. Can't forget to get a bunch of players too. We can even get some USA players for them to go against. Now we have a whole match between the USA and Brazil here. I'll even get a flag in here so everyone understands it. And of course a Brazilian one on the other side. Just can't forget to grab the actual football. Here I am to see how everything is working on our map. Looks like the USA's flag has some nice animation to it, which looks incredibly cool. I just don't understand why the wall just went up like that. But it's okay. At least we got these walk speeds to make our journey to the field there easier. Look at that! This looks awesome! Everyone seems to be ready to get some kicks in. We also have the ball that we can actually kick around, which is really cool. Can we at least get a goal on this? Come on! You can do it! Let's go! One to zero for the map. These ones look pretty good, but this one had a bit of trouble. Look at how bugged it came out. Everything is out of place. I'm not sure at all what happened here. Do the United States, and I'll give you 100,000 Robux. Whoa! Are you serious? I'll do it! Over on this side, we'll have to change the spawn a bit. Like these blocks being red. And those blue ones give the feel of the flag a lot better. An awesome thing I want to do is go over to the mountain and delete all the trees around it. Because right on top of it, I want to get a United States statue. Well, this one looks good, but I'm not sure what I'm looking for. So let's take it out because the Statue of Liberty would look incredible right here. It's a really big symbol of the United States, so that would look great on our map. Since we're doing landmarks, why don't I just delete this bridge right here? The Golden Gate would look incredible right there. It's another very well-known place to put in here. We just need to get the arch further from it, and I think that actually looks great. Another well-known place there is the White House. As the name says it's really white. And this is where the president of the United States resides, so it would make a lot of sense if it was in place of our town hall. So guess this one's going away. Now get it right there. Differently from the football they have in Brazil, their American football is very far from the one they have in Brazil. So we just need to open up some space for it, and I think it actually looks great. For some reason, it left these things on the ground, just some piles of grass. It's not gonna be empty like that. We gotta get some players in here too, even if they're looking kinda angry right now. Hey, add some famous Roblox YouTubers too. True, add some in Brazil after that. Of course guys, those sound like good ideas. But before getting them, we need somewhere for them to go. I think the daycare has a nice place for it. So let me delete all of that. Can't forget those parts. And now I'll get that old Roblox house. Everyone knows this one. Just need to make sure it fits right here. I'll also paint it a little bit different. A lot more red for a more youtube -y feel. Right up here, I'll also get the actual YouTube logo. Now inside, we need to get some lights in here. Some gaming computers, since they gotta do some editing. And some decorations like these YouTube boxes. Oh yeah, the awards would look awesome right there on the walls. A little old YouTube poster. And a bunch of other symbols around the house. With that, our YouTuber house looks pretty damn nice. Especially 
expect this flipped one right here. Let's just get that right. And done! It's finally time to get our YouTubers. Starting with Ibella. She's got a pretty funny skin. I like it. We gotta get our boy Mr. Flim Flam. This is basically the biggest Roblox YouTuber of all time. And I can't forget to have myself since I'm a part of this group too. Let me get Creecraft in here. Cleanse Beam as well. I think those are pretty nice already. I didn't add that many, but if you'd like to see a YouTuber Brookhaven, leave it in the comments below. Where are the Brazilian YouTubers? Oh yeah, I almost forgot to get our Brazilian boys. For that we'll be taking the whole mall out of the way. Bye bye. I'll just add the exact same house we made before. Just place it right over there. Now let me just take most of these guys out. Just leaving myself of course. The first Brazilian YouTuber I'll get is gonna be King. Then I'll get problems. This guy is quite well known so we can't forget him. Let me get Mel on here. And Chad as well. Natasha Panda gotta be here. And that seems like a pretty good number. Now continuing on the Brazilian side we gotta add some more stuff. Something we're known for is our diversity in animals. Like our birds. Like this parrot that I think only exists in Brazil. So that's why we'll have a bunch of birds just flying around our Brazilian Brookhaven and they actually fly. We just need to spread them around the city so it looks realistic. I just log back in to see how these birds are doing. Whoa! Did you see that? These things actually work. These birds are gonna make Brazil's side look so damn cool. Just look at how different the map is with the bridge and even the YouTube logo. Doesn't the Statue of Liberty look marvelous? I also got a Roblox one just so it fit better. With that our map already looks so incredible. You do have to be careful about these birds. They're flying quite low over here. Something Brazil is known for are the beaches. They're hot and really nice. So over here we'll make our very own beach with parasols and beach chairs. Of course we need to have a sand castle. I always love doing these at the beach. We can also get some palm trees. They're the staple. Can't forget to get some buildings around it too. Like little places to grab a bite. And with that we have a beautiful beach already. Since we got a symbol of the USA in the mountain, on this side we gotta get something as well. Which will of course be Christ the Redeemer. It's basically the big statue we have in Brazil like they do with the Statue of Liberty. I think it would look good in that corner. Just need to make it a lot bigger. It looks awesome. I also got a Roblox version of it so it doesn't look weird. Oh, I can't forget to use this little mound. Just put it right below the statue since in real life it's on top of a big hill. We can get a bunch of monkeys as well since there's tons of these in Brazil. They're also really cute. We are also known for our coffee. So gotta have a few coffee shops here. Let's move over to the United States for a bit. Everyone knows the Hollywood sign. It's also also on top of a hill. So that's another symbol of theirs we can get. I think it looks good over there. With that I think we're finally done with both these maps. We're finally ready to try it out. Just hope I didn't forget to add anything important. I just logged into it and this is the side of the United States. I even got these speed things to help us go around. For some reason there's smoke coming out of here. I don't know why. I hope it's not a ghost. Let's just have a little look around and see what we changed and if everything works nicely. Here's the White House. Can we go into it? Let me just use Use my camera. Oh! The inside is actually modeled. Maybe if I jump on this sub, I can get in there. Perfect. So I guess this is how the White House looks. I'm not sure if this is how it actually is, but in my game it is. There's tons of rooms in here. In this one, they're watching some American football. Let me go on my way. By the way, I'm playing this with a bunch of my subs. And if you want to play with me or just show up on videos, go follow my Roblox profile at NandoYT. Just click the three little dots and then the follow button and you'll be golden. I'll have another look around. I want to see if our YouTubers are doing well or not. Let me see. Look at that. They're all just hanging out. Even I'm in here. We also got some gaming setups that sadly don't do much. They do have RGB though. Now this mouse looks more like a pancake than anything. Why don't we make our way to the football field? Here are our players who for some reason lost their limbs. Dude, why did this even happen to them? I don't think they're doing well enough to play an actual match. One of the subs took a Brazilian car in here. He's an actual outlaw. Here we also have the Hollywood sign, which looks cool. There's the Golden Gate and also the Statue of Liberty, which is just really awesome looking. It's finally time to cross over to Brazil. Let's just jump and we're here. On this side, we got the flag swaying in the wind. And if you go into this house, you'll find a bunch of Brazilian YouTubers. There's not that many in here, but hopefully we'll work on the YouTuber Brookhaven in the future. Here's all of our monkeys. I'm just not sure who threw these boys into the ground. They don't seem to be 
too well. Wait, what's going on? Dude, what's that gigantic monkey? Is it a vehicle or something? Oh, it just fell to the ground. At least we can still try this Brazilian car right here. Just so we can have a look around this side. There's the letters. Our flag again. Something happened to our statue though. Most of it is just gone. Yes, we had a few technical problems in the end. But if you guys want to get into it and explore further into the map, you should follow my Roblox profile at NandoYT. Click the three little dots that you'll be able to follow me just fine. That'll help you participate in my videos or just play with me sometimes. Now if we go down, you'll find the official Nando fan group. You gotta become a member if you want to get some news about me. It's also here where you'll find the experiences I've made in Roblox. We also have a few shirts in the store like the same one I usually use. So if you want one, you can just buy it here. So that's... Whoa! What just happened? Anyways, guys, that's gonna be it for today. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like on the video and comment down below what was your favorite part of this map. Make sure to watch one of the videos on screen right now. They're just as fun as this one. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for even more maps and everything Roblox. Have a good one!